Police 10A Talk. Joel here uh, at the good old trusty workbench. Just wanted to spend a minute going over a, a product I've discovered. Uh, I recently, a month or so ago, entered the, the world of suppressor owners. And the, uh, because of the increased pressure in the gun, I was experiencing a lot of blowback around the charging handle. I, I had a Bravo Company ambidextrous gunfighter charging handle on it and still got a lot of blowback. So uh, ended up going with a company called Armageddon Tactical, their GMS-15 charging handle. You can see a major difference. Here's a, just a stock charging handle here. And you can imagine how when this is in the receiver, all the gas that comes out around here. Well, with the, with the Armageddon one with the hood over it, it uh, redirects the gas away from you. As I said, this is the Armageddon Tactical GMS 15 Gen 2 charging handle. It is a uh, Ambidextry, it has the GMS stands for gas management system. It has a, a diagonal gas port and chamber in it that encloses the rear of the upper receiver. It uh, blow, uh, redirects the blowback gas away from the, the shooter. It uh, fits AR 15s, M16s, M4 style weapons. Uh, Anything chambered in 5.56, 223, 9mm, 300 blackout. It's machined from billet 775 aluminum. The, uh, the latch here is heat, heat treated 4140 steel. All the aluminum components of the charging handle are plated with a Mill spec type two, I'm sorry, type three class two. It's Teflon impregnated to uh, help reduce uh, friction between the moving parts. All the steel components on it are protected by mag phosphate. The actual section here where the, the ambidextrous charging handle is, is, is virtually sealed. Um, I'm sure if you submerge the weapon, you could get some kind of, some kind of contaminant in it. Uh, the biggest thing I had with the other Ambi charging handle I had on here was it was forever snagging and unlocking the charging handle. So every time I'd go to mount the weapon, I'd have to bump the charging handle to make sure the charging handle was seated. I have not experienced that at all. With this, uh, for some reason, I guess the way they beveled the corners off of it, it just does not snag on your gear. Uh, give you an example, I've got my upper here from my M4. I'm just going to move it around a little bit. And I'm going to just put the old, as you can see, with just a standard charging handle in it. You have this whole area here, around here, and back here where the, where the gas is when you're firing suppressed. Because of the increased pressure in the, in the weapon, after about five, six rounds, if you're a pretty hardy person, uh, you pretty much have to stop because the ammonia smell just gets absolutely ridiculous. So then here's the Armageddon charging handle, maybe. And you can see how it totally encases this rear section and it redirects the gases through these channels and redirects everything back out the front. Uh, I got this one, uh, and this is an ambidextrous 
unlock button here on the rear. Like if you lock open on a, uh, if your bolt locks to the rear on a mag or anything, and you need to get the charging handle forward, you can get it with this big central button. You can get it either side. It, it doesn't have any flex in it. I've charged off of both sides with both hands. On some charging handles, when I'm charging, it's like I can feel, I don't know if it's flex in the charging handle or just an ill-fitted charging handle. But I don't experience that with this Armageddon tactical one. Uh, if you're shooting, you don't even necessarily have to be shooting suppressed with it to have one. Uh, it's probably the best charging handle that I have I have run into, and I've I've had quite a few of them. I have had PRIs, uh, Bravo Company, just to name a few of them. So if you're looking for a a good charging handle, give Armageddon Tactical a look. They also make them for uh, 308 rifles as well. And uh, in closing, I would like to give a shout out to a little business I stumbled on called Valhalla Tactical. Uh, when I was looking for a gift for this, the manufacturer was out. I stumbled up on it one day on the internet. It was on a Sunday. And I emailed Aaron, one of the owners at Valhalla Tactical, and he actually responded to my email on a Sunday. So I just want to give them a shout out. That's that's customer service the way it's supposed to be done. So if you're looking for a charging handle, check out Armageddon Tactical. If you're looking for any kind of tactical gear, uh, check out Aaron at Valhalla Tactical. Uh, this charging handle was, I want to say, $80. So guys, check it out. Give us a like or subscribe. And... Uh, Stay safe.